Hello everyone. Today, I want to introduce you to ArchCraft OS, a lightweight and elegant Linux distribution based on Arch Linux. ArchCraft OS stands out with its minimalist user interface, high performance, and deep customization capabilities, making it ideal for users who appreciate simplicity without sacrificing flexibility. ArchCraft OS comes with lightweight window managers like OpenBox and BSPWM, allowing your computer to run smoothly even on older hardware. This operating system not only offers a more user-friendly Arch Linux experience but also provides access to a rich repository of applications, easily installable via the Rufus. If you're looking for a lightweight, modern, and highly customizable Linux operating system, ArchCraft OS is definitely worth a try. To download ArchCraft OS, start by visiting the official website at archcraft.io. On the homepage, find the download button or link, which should be easy to spot and then choose a server that suits your internet connection. The file is quite lightweight, so it will download quickly. Here, I selected the Google Drive link to download it. After downloading the ISO file, Insert your USB drive and open the Rufus software. Since many of you are probably already familiar with Rufus, I won't go over the instructions again. In just about two minutes, you'll have a USB drive with the ArchCraft OS installation file ready to go. On the computer where you want to install ArchCraft OS, Adjust the BIOS settings to prioritize booting from the USB drive where you previously installed the ISO file. Now, insert the USB drive into the computer, then power it on. You don't need to do anything else the computer will automatically boot from the USB. After successfully booting into the main screen, click on Start, then select Install ArchCraft OS. Follow the on-screen instructions to proceed with the installation. The installation process may take up to 20 minutes, so please be patient. Once the installation is complete, restart your computer and remove the USB drive. Best of luck with your installation, and see you in the next video.